2 Peter chapter 3, it talks about people in the latter days saying, where's the promise of this coming? For all things continue as they were from the beginning of the creation. Mm -hmm. That concept mm -hmm. that what you see in the present, what's happening right now, what's happening in the creek down below, what is happening in every place on the earth is the way it's always been. It's always been for all of earth history. The passage goes on to say, for this they are willingly ignorant. Mm -hmm. They're not just ignorant of these truths, they're purposely rejecting these truths and it lists the, the creation and the flood. These are apparently events, according to the Bible, that aren't like the present. Right. And the neat thing is, that's what we see here. That cliff isn't actually in place. That cliff, it belongs about a thousand feet up. It slid down to its current location. Uh -huh. That's a pretty big boulder. That's huge, that's okay, massive. Now, now what kind of process in the present slides blocks that big down? This mm -hmm. thing continues for a mile, mm -hmm. but inside those rocks are yet further evidence of an event before that that's even bigger, even more unlike the present. Mm -hmm. And then inside those rocks are also fossils of a time period that's very different than the present. Uh -huh. So that according to the claims of scripture and according to my own experience, you can't use the present to, to judge the past, to understand the past.